We have found uh, two bodies in Deer Creek, uh, about a mile east of town. A man charged with killing two girls in Delphi, Indiana. Police say 50-year-old Richard Allen was taken into custody last Friday. He Richard Allen. Richard Allen was arrested on October 31st and charged. 50-year-old Richard Allen of Delphi. Richard Allen. To Richard Allen's been gun. Been charged for their murders. Records show Allen has lived in the Delphi community for at least 16 years. Celebrate. But the arrest of Richard M. Allen. On February 13, 2017, Two Indiana teenagers, Abigail Williams, 13, and Liberty German, 14, went for a walk in the woods near the abandoned Monin High Bridge. They never returned home. Their bodies were discovered on Valentine's Day morning, sparking a torrent of news coverage and social media speculation that engrossed the attention of people around the world. A grainy photo of the suspected killer walking across the bridge and a chilling cell phone recording of his voice saying down the hill captured the public's attention. Numerous possible suspects were brought to the attention of the authorities, but dismissed, leaving everyone wondering who could have committed such a heinous crime. Author Nick Edwards, host of the wildly popular True Crime Garage podcast, was fascinated by the case and for years conducted his own extensive research and commentary. As such, he was able to dissect the investigation that included an extensive list of possible suspects, such as a hatchet-wielding lunatic, a kidnapper with unusual tattoos, a murderous pastor, a rapist, and a father and son catfishing team. Then, in late October 2022, local pharmacy technician Richard Allen was charged with the murders. His arrest raised multiple questions about how he was able to evade law enforcement for so long and what motivated him to commit such a horrific crime. In the Delphi murders, the quest to find the man on the bridge, Edwards and his best-selling co-author Brian Whitney, you have a very soft voice, Susan, provide a detailed account of the investigation from the day the girls' bodies were found to the events leading up to Alan's arrest and a unique insight into the minds of the killer and those who work tirelessly to bring him to justice. The book that we're featuring this evening is The Delphi Murders, The Quest to Find the Man on the Bridge, with my special guest, journalist and author and host of True Crime Garage, Nick Edwards. Welcome to the program. And thank you so much for this interview, Nick Edwards. Thank you so much for having me on True Murder, Dan. 